This is Chad Boudreau back at the alumni game. I got Al Hansen after the game. Uh, Al, I saw you knock down a couple threes. You still got it. You still look like you're in game condition. What was the difference between the gold team and the black team? What What was it today? Uh, simply Tom Hecker. Yep. You know, we had him on the gold team. He's within a month of hip surgery, hip replacement. And we played him too many minutes tonight. Uh, Dylan Page wanted uh, when he was our coach tonight and he kept asking for a sub, but Dylan Page kept telling him to play through it. It just hurt us tonight. That's too bad. You know, sometimes rotations can kill a team. And a guy like Tom Hecker, who at one time was probably a below average player, um, but now it's he's beyond his years when it comes to basketball. Yeah, but when you talk to Tom, he still thinks he still has it or he's still hoping that he gets it. But uh, Tom Hecker, he's a great guy. He just never had any basketball sense. Yeah, you know, everybody's blessed with different things, and basketball obviously is not Tom's. Right. Um, talk a little bit about your career here, being a part, being a Milwaukee guy, to be able to come back to, and play at UWM, be able to come back to the alumni game, the, the Milwaukee family, the UWM family. Talk a little bit about that. I mean, the UWM family is great. A lot of my teammates and alumni, we still keep in touch, so that's, that's something that I look forward to and having that lifelong bond of being able to call on guys when you need them and, you know, just get advice from bigger brothers or younger brothers. It's always good to be able to count on them. I got one question for you. I was at a ball game that Al coached, um, I think it was last summer. You threw a clipboard and broke that. Um, obviously frustrated. Where'd you get that from? Was that Coach Burrow? Was that Coach Jeter? Where did you get the, because it was well played out. Obviously you've seen that before and you knew what you were doing. I definitely seen it before. Uh, you know, how can they say it was 50% of Bruce Pearl and 50% of Rob Jeter? But both of them broke the, the clipboards as a result to my mess ups. And I don't know how those teams respond, but your team responded. Yeah, like I told the guys, you know, I will only ask you guys to do something that my coach has asked me to do. And you guys will be able to respond. Guard and make threes. Guard and Thanks, make threes. Thanks, Al. <laughs> <laughs> you crazy, man.